Okay everybody, welcome to today's video. In today's video, I'm going to take a regular Western or just a basic bareback pad and put a Western girth on it so it doesn't slip and slide around because most of the time they just have these silly little things right here and let's just face it, those don't work very well. So I'm gonna show you how to change that up and put a girth on it. All right, so here's the tools that you are going to need. Um, Sasha's going to help me out with this. Uh, you're going to need a blowtorch or at least some way to heat up your uh, item that you're going to use to make your holes. You know what? Just a good old fashioned uh, Phillips head works really good. Don't use one that you ever really want to use again because uh, once it's gotten that nasty black stuff on it, it's really hard to go back. And uh, Sharpie, if you're using a black... Uh, you're doing anything with black nylon, a silver sharpie shows up really well. You'll also need a really good pair of scissors and uh, you will need some extra little bits of leather to tie everything together. Okay, all you have to do to get those holes made is warm up the end of your screwdriver under your blowtorch, you use adult supervision, and make sure you have safety glasses on. Get it nice and hot. And that's all you've got to do to poke it right on through. Okay, so I cut this and made it into an off billet and burnt it. So this is where it's going to attach. As you can see, the holes are right there. Now I have an extra little bit. I'm going to use that as my latigo. So I'm going to fold it over. I'm going to make my three holes. And I'm going to come around and I'm going to attach the latigo to the bottom over here so we can attach a cinch to it. Now we have our holes all the way through, both pieces and nice and melted in. We're just going to lock them in once in place with a little piece of leather. Okay, got that secured just with a basic little knot back there. You can do it any way you like. Actually, I could have done it the other way and then it would have come up a little bit better. But oh well, that's what you got. Check out these. Okay, once you're ready to actually put the holes in your latigo, mark them about every four to six inches, whatever you feel comfortable with. Uh, silver Sharpie helps on a black piece. Get your uh, blowtorch nice and hot, and you can get about three holes done before you need to re-warm up your device that you're poking holes with. Okay, there is your latigo. Now all we have to do is add a cinch and put it on the horse. And there's the cinch that we will be adding. Okay, so this is what it looks like on a horse. And um, obviously you're gonna have to fit it to your particular horse. Uh, we are going to have to have way smaller of a girth. We have a 28 on this horse. She's a small quarter horse. And um, remember, it's gonna be a little bit different because you have a drop down there. <clears throat> now you could further mod modify it by bringing it up higher and having your buckle higher, but uh, depending on the horse that you're gonna put it on is gonna depend upon the size of the girth. Thank you so much for joining us on today's video, and if you enjoyed the video, please give us a like, and if you haven't already, please subscribe, and to see more, check out our playlists.